Hello friends. Welcome to our channel. And I hope you're all keeping fine. In this video we present to you a unique recipe of biryani made with camel meat. Camel meat is a good source of protein and also lower in cholesterol as compared to other red meats. Biryani is a mixed flavorful rice which is layered with cooked meat or vegetables. It's believed to originate from the Asian countries and the Middle East and it is made with a lot of whole spices. Though it's high in calories, yet it's a remarkable dish which is prepared during occasions and festivities. Here we're going to make a special biryani with camel meat. So let's get started. We're going to do it in three stages. The first stage is a stage of preparation. Let's make the special spices mix. Into a grinder jar, add peppercorns, cinnamon sticks, cardamom, cloves, and bay leaf. Grind them coarsely. This special spices will be using while we cook the meat. So keep it aside. Next, we are going to make the ground paste. Take garlic, ginger, and green chilies. Grind them into a paste. This paste will be using while we cook the rice as well as the meat. So let's keep it aside. Now let's prepare for the garnishing. Into a bowl, take saffron. Add milk. And mix well. Then keep it to rest. Till the milk turns yellow with the color of saffron. Also keep it aside. And the last part of preparation is roasting. For this, heat a pan at low. Add ghee to it. Add cashew nuts. And roast it. Roast it till they turn light brown in color. Once the cashews are half roasted, we're going to add the raisins. Roast them till they turn nice and crisp. Now keep this aside. Next we're going to the second stage of this recipe. That is to cook the biryani rice. Here I'm taking a pressure cooker. Heat at medium flame. Add ghee. Then add the whole spices. Peppercorns. Cinnamon sticks. Cloves. Cardamom and bay leaves. Roast them for a few seconds. And now we're going to add the sliced onion and sort all together. Sort them till the onions are nice and soft. Then we're going to add the freshly ground paste of garlic, ginger and chilies. Sort them all together. Remember to keep at low flame. And sort them for 3 to 5 minutes. In the meantime, let's clean and keep the rice ready. This is the type of rice which is used for making biryani. Now add the rice into the pressure cooker. Give a good mix.
Here I'm going to fry the rice for few minutes. This gives a nice texture to the rice on cooking. As well as the rice won't break. When the rice pops or crackles, we get to know that the rice is perfectly fried and is ready for the next stage of cooking. Then we are going to add water. Water is usually taken in double as compared to the rice. Add salt. Add fresh lemon juice. Give a good mix. And we cook till the rice is 90% done. So now here we have the biryani rice which is perfectly cooked. So then let's move to the third stage of this special biryani recipe. Here we have the camel meat which is clean and kept to drain. First I'm going to pressure cook the meat. Add oil and heat it. Then I'm adding sliced garlic, ginger and green chilies. Now we're going to add the meat which is cleaned and drained. Just give a mix. Add salt, add pepper powder and also add some coriander leaves and mix all together. Then we're going to cook till the meat is perfectly done. So after a while, here we have the meat which is perfectly done. Now heat a pan, add oil, we're going to add some sliced onion, and sort it. Till they turn nice and soft. Then add the ground paste of ginger, garlic and green chilies. Sort them together. Once done, we are going to add the spices. First, turmeric powder, coriander powder, red chilli powder and the special ground spices. Roast them for about 1 to 2 minutes. Once the spices are roasted well, we are going to add the tomatoes. Then cover with a lid and continue cooking till the tomatoes are smashed well. It may take about 3 to 5 minutes. So now here we have the gravy ready. Let's add the cooked meat to it. Coat them well with the gravy and the spices. I also would like to add some fresh coriander leaves.
Now we're going to cover and cook for few minutes. This helps the meat to absorb the spices well. We are almost towards the end of cooking. So now let's set the biryani in two or three layers. Into the same pan of meat, I'm going to add a layer of rice. Spread it evenly. And then garnish with saffron milk. Also garnish with roasted cashew nuts and raisins. And add some fresh coriander leaves. So this layer is almost done. Now let's make the last layer in the same way. Rice. Then garnish with saffron milk. Spread the roasted cashew nuts and raisins. And finally garnish with the coriander leaves. Now the last step is to steam the biryani in the same pot. Cover with the lid and keep it airtight. Keep to steam for 15 to 20 minutes at low flame. A special biryani with camel meat is almost done. This is an amazing recipe. Do make it at home and enjoy with your family on special occasions. Always serve it hot and enjoy. Thank you for being with us. Stay safe and healthy.